Hey, what's up guys? Dig and Dad. Um, back at the farm for a little post-event cleanup. Uh, see if uh, anyone missed anything. All right, man. See you on the first hole. Dig and Dad! Can you dig <laughs> Here on my first signal right in front of the uh, dining hall and uh, really making me work for it. Somewhere under that, under that root. Um, I mean, it's in there, I just can't get down to it. It rang up high, so we shall see. Well, I think I was digging down to a pipe. Well, you win some, you lose some. On to the next one. So we got Jeff here. Surfers find, pretty awesome horseshoe. Still got the uh, tax in it and everything. Yeah, nice find, man. All right, thanks, man. Yeah, buddy. Just found uh, this B101, I think, flashlight. I don't even know if that's a radio station anymore. Uh, kind of cool. All right, on to the next. All right, right next to the B101 flashlight. I swung over again and found this thing. No idea what it is. I don't know if it's a can. What the heck? No, oh, I'll clean it up. See if I can uh, identify it. If not, see you on the next one, guys. Kind of cool. Looks like I, uh, Ran into an old bottle dump. Uh, I don't know if you can see it real well, but there's bottles all over the place. Either that or someone had one heck of a party. I'm gonna look around, see if I can find something old, something cool. We'll see. So yeah, definitely some cool bottles around here. Um, I don't know much about bottles, but Ooh, what's it say? Uh, Gib Gibson's? Can't slip. Uh, what's it say up there? I don't know. Um, it says federal law forbids sale or reuse of this bottle. Okay, writing on the bottom. Got the old patent thing, a little Pennsylvania keystone there. Twenty-seven forty-one. I don't, I don't know how to date this kind of stuff, so I'm gonna have to do some research. This is a cool bottle. Again, it's got some writing on the bottom there. Definitely taking those home. Another kind of cool bottle. Let's see what this one is. Um, well, the writing's upside down on this one. For for half bottle, pour to here. All right, so it marks a half a bottle. I don't know why. Made in USA. Pretty neat, man. Sir, cert to some patent. I don't know. Definitely cool though. Keep those in a pile and come back for them. Unless I want to haul them around. All right, so here's my bottle hoard. I don't know how I'm going to get them out, but uh, definitely some pretty cool ones. Again, I never, never really. This one's cracked, unfortunately. Don't know much about bottles, but uh. Definitely pretty neat. I don't know. They all have writing on the bottom. It's maybe an old baby bottle. Little flask, Douglas, what's that say? Dirt glass. So capped. All right, guys. Well, I think that's gonna do it for me for today. 
I will see you on the next one. So I'm walking out of the woods and uh, ran into this hanging in the tree. Whole bunch of wind chimes. Kind of thought about taking them, but I don't know. You guys ever see the Blair Witch? Yeah, I'm not getting into any of that. No, thank you. So here they hang for, uh, for all the animals to enjoy, I guess. All right, got pulled out of the woods a little uh, early yesterday. I uh, had to spend some family time. So uh, so I am um, gonna come back to the old KG field. Mess around for a little bit. See you in there. All right, this was ringing up uh, like 11, 12, 13. Um, after getting through a lot of junk. Um, something iron. Some kind of uh, farm, off of farm equipment, I guess. I don't know, pretty big. Kind of cool. Beats me. All right, see you on the next one. All right, just uh, dug a, um, a deep jumpy signal. Uh, got down pretty deep, was scooping it out, and then uh, spotted that. Okay. Pretty neat. Kind of cool, there's some writing on it. I think it says Reading PA. Not sure I can get that on video. Definitely cool though. All right guys, I'll see you on the next one. Hey buddy. Got a little visitor here from a cat. Looks friendly. He has a collar on, so I guess he's a house cat. But uh, decided to take this jumpy signal and um, open up my plug and found like a cool little chain, I think. Yeah, chain. Nothing really to it, just a chain. Alright, see you on the next one, guys. Alright, so same hole that chain came out of, and uh, digging around a little more, and I found a tag. Maybe this will tell us what it was. Uh, maybe not. Oh, yeah, there we go. There we go. It says 2000, oh, so not old. 2001 Berks County, PA. I that's a dog tag. So I guess it was a dog's chain. All right. Right on. On to the next one. All right. Another faint signal here. Uh, dug my plug. Digging around. And I think I found a coin shape in here. Um, definitely a coin shape. Oh, that's nice. What is that? Dude, I just found another KG too. Holy crap. Oh, that is a nice one. Oh, wow. Holy loving. Yes. Oh. oh man, I wish it was uh, sunnier out so you could see it. I'm gonna clean this up a little bit, try to get a date on it. Oh man, I'll be right back with you. All right, so there it is. Definitely a KG2. Um. I do believe the date is 1737. Let's see if I can get a better picture of that. 1737, see Britannia. Really see King George II really good. 
Man, that is so awesome. My second one ever found. Same field, about 75 yards away from the last one I saw, or found. Man, that is an incredible shape. Love it. Well, the King George field sure didn't disappoint again. Uh, second time here, uh, second KG2. Gotta love it. Can't wait till he moves the field down. Really wanna hit it hard. Uh, see you on the next one, guys. Stay gold.